try to look lovely. <laughs> Real adventure begin here. This is interesting. <laughs> Right here, orange line. Maybe you show him the the other schedule. There's a train that connects to terminal terminal three, right? Metro three to where? Three to where? This is a three, right? Yeah, this is terminal three. From here, you want to go to where? I want to go to here, end of the blue line. By train, right? Yeah. About train or metro or it runs at 4:55. It's the yeah. first train. The metro is starting at 5:30. 5.30. We have made it through immigration. I don't want to sit on the chair. Because you didn't leave me any room. So we made it through immigration, but the first train was oh supposed to leave at 4.55. And... Or no, at no. 4.15. Now it's 4. Babe. Yeah, but because we're at the second stop, it leaves at 5.15, so these oh. the trains that come to the airport actually don't leave until 5.15. But the immigration is super easy, and now we're just going to wait around till the train, depending on how much the Uber is. Oh, the chicken? Yeah, we're going to check to see how much the Uber is first. So, how much would it be for the train? I don't know, probably a lot cheaper. Let's see, we will tell you guys later. It's like pretty smoggy, as you can see behind us. So I bought a mask before I came and I had one when I was in Bangkok too. You just never know. Uh, after being outside for a certain amount of time, it could really affect you. It kind of give you a headache if you're not so used to it. It's a headache. You got a headache already? Maybe because I didn't sleep as well on the, uh, in the airplane, I think. So you think that's why? That could be why. It's awfully confusing your first time in a country trying to figure out where to go. Oh, there's no line or color or anything. It's just like, say, platform number two, number three. You have to go down. So I think we have no choice, but going so down. We have to get to the end of the blue line, and it was about 60. You have to go there. 60 a piece. I'm not too sure what the currency is. 60 yet. rupee. 60 rupee a piece. Rupee or rupee? A rupee. Rupee. Here. Davaka section. Oh, yeah. there you go, because the airport's red. Yeah, so we have to go orange to blue, blue over. So which way now? This is orange line. Dwaga sector twenty one. I have no idea. I, I think I, so, I get based on my assumption because we don't know where to go and to. there is only two, two lines and there is that one go to the Waga sector which is like gonna go back to the opposite side that we want to go so you have to basically know the map and then for us we have to go to New Delhi station New Delhi railway station easy for me after I get to see the map and everything because due to the reason it's, sim it's similar to the system in Bangkok in the aspect of like the they are there will be two separate way and there will be two separate direction so there will be the name so what you need to know is the end station yeah. It's exactly kind of like in Mexico too. This they have the airport, airport train now. So you have to ride the airport metro to the actual metro, and then you can ride the normal metro to the actual end destination that you want to go. This station is so far. We want to go to New Delhi, New Delhi metro station, and then we can change the line from New Delhi to the blue line. Yeah, so you go to from sector 21 to New Delhi. So actually, there are two ways that you can do first of all take a picture of the whole metro map which you can take a picture at the metro station 
or you can download the app. Yeah, the Delhi Metro app. We don't have it, but local. Yeah, we yeah they it, recommended right? it to yeah. us. We just so, didn't download it before we got here. Unfortunately, I didn't see that when I was looking at everything else. I just took a picture of the Google Maps and the train system, and it somewhat works, but it's different. Than, the map looks a lot different. I would say this airport train here in New Delhi. You know what time is it right now? Yeah, it's 5.20. Look at how many people with 5.20. I know. Well, it's also, this is the only line from the airport that just opened up. Uh, so it's everybody from the night flights and everybody in the airport. It's first train to get to the subway. It's 30 rupees. It's 40. 40 for you? So you I pay 40? Depends on where you go. But we go to the end of the line. Yeah, we go to the end of the line. Thank you. I just follow that footprints. So blue footprints, blue line, yellow footprints, yellow line. We follow the footprints. <laughs> Yeah. First time in India, first impression in India. First of all, it's really cold. It's not that cold. <laughs> it's 11 degrees Celsius. That's not that bad. Winter in Thailand is about, I think Bangkok go as low as 16 degrees Celsius, but here it's 11 degrees Celsius. So explain about the arrow on the train. Oh, it's my bad. My fault. Okay. In case you are in rush, you just hop in the train and yeah. then don't know which direction, you know? So the good way is to notice the, the arrow. Yeah, it'll tell you exactly which direction you want to go into. Yeah, it's not the way that um, the direction of the train, but it's the way that the door is open. <laughs> <laughs> I was so confident that for sure. That is the direction. It doesn't tell the direction, guys. It's just like the way that you can get off. One more stop. We got to transfer. Blue line splits down the middle, so you actually have to transfer to the second version of the blue line. Take it to the end. Take it to the end, and then take a trike to our apartment. And it's only like a quarter of a mile down the road from the end of the metro, so we're almost there. It's super early in the morning still. It's you know what I'm excited. Like six o'clock, right? I think it's like six o'clock here. The airport is right here. Yeah. And our apartment is on the opposite side of the city at the end of the blue line. Yeah. So everything that we want to do in New Delhi is actually in the middle. On the middle to east side of the city, where Old Delhi is as well. Yeah. Speaking of Old Delhi, do you know that actually it's Delhi, Delhi and New Delhi is not the same. Oh really? No, it's not the same. So basically, there are like I think nine sub district in Delhi, and New Delhi is one of them. Because if we talk about Old Delhi, that's why I just want to mention about Delhi and New Delhi. So we arrived at 3.50 and we've been traveling for about two hours. But we had to wait a little bit. We had to wait until 5 in order to get on the actual airport metro. It doesn't open until 5 o'clock. So we've been traveling, full-time traveling on trains and subways and airport metros for right over an hour now and we're just about to get on the right line <laughs> and now we have to take it to the end the last line yeah the last line so new delhi is huge yep that's trippy it's so eerie here because of the fog and everything yeah it's so creepy at like three in the morning six in the morning here with like i don't know if it's pollution or fog but it's like super smoky <laughs> Okay. We have made it to the end of the line and let me tell you it is eerie out here. Alright, let's get this last trike, make it to the apartment and get some food. 
<laughs> Real adventure begin here. Huh? In the back? Ah, uh, in the back. Ah, it's a Kapita, Kapita. You give him the address? This is interesting. <laughs> more and more. Oh my god, water balls in single mouth. Yeah, it's so good. Butter balls? Yeah, it's water balls. This is gold cup. Who is here? I don't know what this is called, but it looks really good.